It is over. Thank homies. It's over. <laughs> YouTube, as we know it, is going to end. PewDiePie has screwed us. We are all screwed. It is over. What? What the fuck is happening? PewDiePie has done an injustice to this society, to this community, to this race of human being. He he said the N word. What a fucking nigger. Jeez, oh my god, what the fuck? Sorry, but what the fuck? What's up, dank homies? Nero here, and today we're gonna talk about PewDiePie. If you guys don't know, PewDiePie had a live stream recently, and he uh, <clears throat> he messed up a little bit. As you saw in the clip in the intro, PewDiePie was playing Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. He killed a dude. Um, I guess one of his teammates died. He was frustrated. You know, he was he was really frustrated that his teammate got killed. I guess. And so he, he, he blurted out the worst thing he could possibly say, which is the N-word. What a fucking n -er. Now, it normally doesn't bother me if someone says the N-word. You know what I mean? I do not care. If you haven't noticed, my skin is light skin, but I'm black, I swear. Now, what bothers me is who it is saying the N-word. PewDiePie has a history of getting involved in controversial stuff involving race or Nazism. Now, although it may be jokes and stuff, which I get, I laugh at the jokes all the time, but like what happens is news outlets will take those videos and then they put them in articles making not just PewDiePie look bad, but make all of YouTube look bad because he's the biggest channel on YouTube. So now advertisers see that in which they saw it in the past and then they started pulling their ads away from YouTube which has now caused which is now known as the YouTube ad apocalypse where everybody's earning less money on each video and a lot of videos are getting demonetized if they say certain words in a video so in a sense a lot of people kind of blame PewDiePie for the whole ad apocalypse that is going on now now how does this situation differ from the last situations the last situations was when he had a bunch of jokes that a lot of people took out of context or whatnot but this wasn't a joke he said it out of pure anger who says that out of anger yo everybody type in the chat alex is a stupid you fucking but seriously though in all honesty like i can kind of understand like, if it was a complete accident on PewDiePie's side, I mean, who knows? Maybe he says the N-word with a nice hard R all the time behind the camera. Or maybe he just reads a lot of comments that say that word over and over again, and then it just ends up slipping out by accident. Who knows? I just really wish that, like, him as the biggest channel on YouTube Understandably, he didn't ask to be the biggest channel on YouTube, but knowing that you're the biggest channel on YouTube I wish he would be a little bit more careful of what he says and what he does because what he does affects Everyone else, but in conclusion, um, I still enjoy PewDiePie's videos, you know um, Just hopefully I mean it hasn't affected everybody yet But if it does of course, I'll come back with you guys with some more updates and stuff um but till now, that's all I have to say for today's video. And if you guys enjoyed today's video, go ahead and leave a like. And if you haven't subscribed yet and you want to become a part of the Dank Homes family, then go ahead and do so. And I will see you guys later. It's all you can be certain about. Don't change, don't change, don't change. Even though life ain't the same. Don't change, don't change, don't change.
don't change, don't change, don't change. Life gon' make it happen anyway. And I say, don't change, don't change, don't change. Even though life ain't the same. And they say, don't change, don't change, don't change. But no matter what you go, gonna happen anyway. Hit me up on message.